Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Guys, I got a surprise from Head today. Check this out. It even says teasing. What does that mean? Teasing. You're teasing me. A racket is teasing me. Look at this. It says Radical MP 2021 teasing. I've never seen that before. What exactly does that mean? That you want me to test your racket by teasing me? What's that all about? All right, hang on for some more head. Stay tuned. All right, so time to tease me with the head. Oh, looky, looky here. So that's the new head Radical 2021 that's coming out in uh, January, okay? So it's not out yet, but I guess they're teasing me with this racket. It actually looks good in this cosmetic. Um, we can tell that it's the MP. It's got that cool orange. It doesn't say MP on top, but um, I actually like this cosmetic. Right, that's that's not bad at all. So, wow, I'm just a little amazed. Does it say tease? It even says teasing right here. Check it out. So it's a four and a quarter, right? Radical MP 2021, teasing, again, again. So, uh, I'm gonna take this racket out and try it out with Coach Goo and Coach Chris. So stay tuned. All right, guys, on the court with the prototype Radical MP. All right, I'm gonna hand it over to my editor and show you the racket. There it is, Radical MP 2021. I got my man Coach Goo here and Coach Chris here to test it out today for you. Hang tight. All right, so we just tested the racket out. Um, Coach Goo, what did you think? Um, from all the radicals I played with, uh, I played with the I played with last year's model of the radical, and I think it's a great racket, solid racket, good power, good control. Um, for me, it's pretty solid all all the way around. Even the volleys, the serves, they feel pretty solid. Um, I think it's a, another competitive racket. I would say definitely something that most of the people should try for sure what do you what level do you think um, a person should play with this racket intermediate to collegiate I really? would say honestly I mean I seen like one of my best friends actually uses the radical the older version not this year like not the current year, years version but the, the one that has the webbing on it oh got it okay but um I mean they're great rackets I mean the this year's and the, even the prototype is like I think is similar but but a good change, I would say. Got it. Coach Chris, what did you think? I, I actually really enjoyed hitting with this racket. Um, you know, I'm still someone that's shopping around and looking for a racket to switch with. And uh, this is really good for the intermediate versus at the intermediate and collegiate level players. Um, it handles quite well from the baseline. Um, feels really good too at the net. I would, for me, I would add a little bit more weight to it. 
I know it's still a prototype to it, um, but when I'm taking big cuts at it, it feels like I'm playing with a uh, hundred square inch frame, but it's, what is it? It's 98. 98. 98, exactly. So, um, yeah, it feels really great to play with and can't wait to see the final product. So what did, how did you feel on the serve? How did it feel on a volley? Um, so when I was serving, uh, I felt like um, the head might actually be, um, the, the head of the racket was quite light. So um, I had to quite kind of uh, pick up the speed a little bit as I served. Um, and then on the volleys, I felt like they were quite firm. Um, so I was able to put quite a few um, you know, volleys back through it and it felt great to, to, to as well. Coach Q, what did you think of the serve? I mean, you blasted um, some good ones out For there. me, I mean, I like to have like a lot of whip. That's why the headlight is perfect for me, I think. It's pretty light headed, like the head's pretty light. So for me, when I swing through these, like when you connects, it flies. It's like play with like the Babel up here drive, it like pops when you really hit it. So I mean, it's a great serving racket in my opinion. I would say like for me, I like to serve in volley once in a while. I mean, this is perfect combination. It has a great serve and great serve feel and also great touch at net. So I would definitely hang on to this one. Cool. So I'd like to thank Coach Goo and Coach Chris for being with me today. Where can we find you, Coach Goo? You can find me at agu.tennis, and I'll also be posting that content there. Coach Chris? Uh, you can find me at Christopher Chen, C-H-I-E-N. Right, perfect. So I'm going to take this back to the shop and uh, analyze it a little more for you. So hold tight. So guys, we just tried this racket, uh, Radical MP 2021 edition. Very surprised at how well this played. Uh, we know that from speaking to a bunch of people, they weren't thrilled with the last couple generations, uh, but this one, very surprising. Uh, the words that Coach Chris, Coach Andrew, and even myself used for this racket was stability. So my guess is those spiral fibers that they're adding to all of the new head uh, rackets that are coming out are definitely helping, right? So it deflects and re sends back, the, basically sends back the energy of the ball from impact and redirects it back over. So at impact, the racket flexes a little bit and then shoots it right out of there with more ease, more power, more flex, and more feel and control. So kind of an all around great feeling racket. So we were very surprised, um, pleasantly surprised by this new racket. So we're actually very, uh, you know, we're looking forward to this racket coming out and selling it to you guys. Um, even Coach Chris, who's going to be switching rackets because his rackets are over four years old, was considering using this one. So, hey, got only good things to say about this one. But I wanted to sh see what specs were on this one. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's the same as, you know, what's posted in the current model, but wanted to just quickly check it out. So I got my balance board here. I'm gonna actually try to spec it out for you guys to see if there's any differences. I don't believe there will be, but um, we'll check it out, okay? Hold tight. Okay, so I, add, I added a, uh, Pro overgrip here, um, just because when we're hitting, you know, this is the four and a quarter that they sent me, so that's going to alter a bit, alter things a little bit. That should be it right there. Three twenty three. Three twenty three. So, okay, so we're gonna hit the scale now and see what the rest of the numbers come out. At the scale.
321 on the dot. Swing weight. All right, so let's go and analyze. All right, guys, so let's let's look at the numbers here. There's one actual change uh, that I just found out that in this racket. So they upped this racket weight a bit to 10.6 now. So instead of being 10.4 that it usually is in previous generations, they've upped it to 10.6, so now 300 grams instead of 295. So they added a hair more weight. Um, I thought that was the case when, uh, when he handed me the catalog. So, because it's historically been 10.4. So looking at the numbers here, um, that racket is 321 right the current model strung would be 312 i'm sure that overgrip has something to do with it um balance is 323 324 is the current model so this upper is that racket this lower is the current model that's getting discontinued um so the balance strangely is matches even with the overgrip there and the extra weight so eh. They kept the balance real close, I guess, even with an overgrip. Uh, that's quality control for you. Uh, swing weight. Obviously, they add a little more weight, right? So you're going to get a bigger swing weight, again, with that overgrip. Uh, 68 on the RA. So stiffness remains the same. Now, the beam remains the same also. 20 at the top, 23 in the middle, 21 near the throat. Um, so what this means is flex, this is their stiffness, this is flex again, which equates to that 68. Okay, so that kind of, that's what gives you that radical, unique feel. Like the people who've used this racket in the past kind of know what I'm saying. You kind of get a fast head, right? But at impact, you get a solid feel, right? That's historically been um, the signature of a head radical MP. Um, we definitely felt that out there and we definitely liked that out there. So um, I think the radical basically just got better. It got more stable. Those spiral fibers are doing something. It's making this racket feel better. The extra weight is definitely gonna help. So this is the MP. There is a pro coming out also, uh, plus the rest of the line in January. This will not be Final Cosmetic, okay? It'll definitely be more orange, a lot more orange, but a cool orange. So they sent it to me just like this. We did not string this here with um, new head links tour, like my favorite head string um, in the 16 gauge. I'm not sure the tension though, but it felt like it could be like anywhere from 53 to 55 because it felt pretty tight um, in this new color that I like, it's a cool color, um, my favorite color. But anyways, um, it felt good, it felt good. This combo um, did a good job, right? I, I like this racket a lot. So if you are a Radical fan, uh, Radical MP fan, Radical Pro fan, uh, you will like this newest edition coming out in January of 2021, so. All right, so buy this racket. I know I've been telling you guys to buy a lot of rackets lately, but um, these, are, these are good lately. I haven't really found too many bad rackets out there. All right, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.